Welcome to Tech Blueprint, a window that lets you know the latest technology news in the world. In recent years, the competition between China and the United States in the field of science and technology has become the focus of global attention. The United States has always had a first-mover advantage in the field of science and technology and has always maintained an advantage in many science and technology categories. In order to curb the development of Chinese science and technology, the United States has repeatedly set up technical barriers in the hope of restricting the development of Chinese science and technology. Today, artificial intelligence and chips can be said to have become the core of the scientific and technological competition between China and the United States and have become one of the main areas where both sides want to gain an advantage. However, what the United States did not expect was that in the past half month, two key news came out one after another, indicating that China has made a major breakthrough in these two scientific and technological fields. First, SMIC directly reduced the price of 28 nanometers process chips from $2,500 to $1,500. Behind this nearly halved price is actually SMIC's leapfrog progress in the production scale and technical level of 28 nanometers process chips. You know, as a watershed between mature process chips and advanced process chips, the production scale and technical level of 28 nanometers process chips have actually stabilized long ago. The price of $2,500 in the international market is actually a consensus formed by many chip foundries for a long time. Whether it is top chip foundries such as TSMC and Samsung, or secondary chip foundries such as Global Foundries and UMC, they all have large-scale 28 nanometers process chip foundry business. And even many small and medium-sized chip foundries have related businesses. In the case of overcapacity of mature process chips in the world, it is not that there are no chip foundries that want to get more orders by lowering prices. However, the price of 28 nanometers process chips has not fallen significantly, which actually shows that it is difficult to reduce prices on a large scale under the existing chip production technology and production scale. It is precisely because this price has been stable in the international market for a long time that the industry generally believes that it is difficult to see a large-scale price drop in a short period of time. Therefore, SMIC's price reduction this time has attracted such widespread attention. After all, behind this, it actually means that SMIC has not only made good progress in related technologies again, but also means that SMIC's scale production and mass production capabilities in the field of mature process chips have been further improved. Although the 28 nanometers process chip is not the most advanced chip process technology today, it is the chip field with the widest application range at present. The technological breakthroughs achieved by SMIC in this field are enough to prove that China's core has taken another key step forward. 
Combined with the relevant chip export data previously disclosed by China Customs, it can be seen that China is gradually catching up in the field of mature process chips. In the field of artificial intelligence, there is also good news recently. A Chinese company called DeepSeek has bred the DeepSeek V3 model. Judging from the public data, the performance of this model is basically on par with ChatGPT4 and even surpasses it in some areas. This is actually a microcosm of the rapid development of China's artificial intelligence industry chain. Nowadays, many Chinese technology companies have joined the research and development of the field of artificial intelligence and created many outstanding artificial intelligence big data models. Many Chinese technology companies, including Baidu, Tencent, and Huawei, have performed well in the research and development of artificial intelligence big models and the application of artificial intelligence technology. At the same time, Huawei, Bahrain Technology, and other companies have also developed a number of excellent artificial intelligence chips and have made rapid progress in many fields such as artificial intelligence applications and artificial intelligence chips. Today, China has reached the forefront of the world in the field of artificial intelligence. It can be said that in the development of artificial intelligence, China has been among the best. Even the United States cannot ignore China's rapid development of technology in the field of artificial intelligence. In fact, from the perspective of the entire science and technology field today, China's rapid progress is far more than that. In many fields such as large-scale lifting equipment, CNC machine tools, and 3D printers, China's technological level has reached the forefront of the world. In addition, in the fields of 5G technology and shield machine technology, China can be said to be leading the development of technology.